I just finished redecorating my daughter's bedroom. Quick, come check it out before they destroy it. I showed it to them for the first time last night. I said, I'm so glad you love it, but I need you to pack your bags. This is mommy's room now. My starting point for this room was the Safari Wallpaper by Fromental. Around the picture frame molding, I have a coordinating grass cloth by Thibaut. Because I am a wallpaper person, and my children shall be wallpaper people, is the way of things. I am absolutely in love with this star carpet. It's from their collaboration with Missoni. It is absolutely beautiful, but it also hides all stains. The may or may not have already put it to the test last night. I am fairly certain this Maitland Smith mirror is a portal to Narnia. Also, it would make such a great selfie mirror. Alas, my children are not allowed to have phones until they turn 35. Now, in case you hadn't noticed, we are bow girls in this family. And we will never apologize for that. Now, it felt only right that the piece of furniture I will spend the most time in is covered in my favorite fabric from Casablanca. That's mom math. Also, this lampshade. Now, with this Grammy and art, we are planting the seeds of a mandatory mother-daughter trip to Paris early. I had an obnoxiously specific vision for the bed draperies here, and after canvassing the entire planet, I found that calico corners had crawled inside my brain and created the exact embroidered stripe that I wanted. I added a box pleat ruffle in rose-colored silk, because obviously. Now I would like us to all pause and please share a moment of silence for this bookshelf which will never ever look this good again. It took me an hour and 2.5 glasses of wine last night to make the internet believe we're this organized. Of course, we had to incorporate a little bit of New York into this room and I actually DIY'd this frame. Pause for a reaction. Am I a DIY vlogger now? I would very much like to remove this Alice Palmer lampshade and wear it as a skirt, but alas, this visual comfort floor lamp gets to wear it instead. This is one of my tenants, Eloise. She hasn't paid rent in 